Yo, since it's football season, I had to go ahead and jump in on this guy, Mr. Sterling Sharp. This guy was absolutely phenomenal, and it's a shame he doesn't get his just due. Drafted 7th out of the University of South Carolina in the 88 draft by the Green Bay Packers. Sharp was not to be played with off the rip. This dude has a legit case that he was the number one receiver in the era with Jerry Rice. He could pretty much do anything he wanted on the field. Route running, having breakaway speed, the ability to go up and get in in traffic. Think about this for a second. In his last three seasons, he had a total of 314 catches and 3,854 yards receiving. That's insane. He did all of this while playing in Green Bay in that crazy weather for his career. Sterling Sharp had 595 receptions, 8,134 yards, and 65 tubs. If it wasn't for a serious injury, he would be discussed amongst the wide receiver guards. He only played seven seasons, but in that time, he was five-time pro bowler and three-time all-pro. Even his Hall of Fame brother said that Sterling was better than him. Mr. Sterling Sharp is definitely part of the forgotten.